All right, this is Marlo Briggs and the Mask of Death. Uh, I know nothing about this game. Uh, I hadn't really heard of it at all until uh, I saw that it was on sale for a dollar on Steam. And I was like, well, obviously I should buy Marlo Briggs and the Mask of Death for a dollar. So that's what I did. Uh, so we're going to find out what this game is together. Uh, normal sounds good. Big fancy environment. Big fancy characters. Man, it's hot down here. You fight fires for a living and you're complaining about the heat. Yeah, but I'm on vacation. I just I wish you could have come to a different day, you know? It's not usually like this. Is he gonna be saying I'm on vacation throughout the entire story? I really hope so. It's okay. We're out of here soon. Yeah. Ah, Miss Torres. Lovely to see you again. From the look of things, I take it your work is uh, proceeding well? Well, yes, but... Cloudcraft, uh, you're thinking of Myers Briggs. And you are? Marlo Briggs. Marlo's my boyfriend. He's visiting for a few days. Well, we can always use more workers. Now, Miss Torres, I believe you had an update for me? Yes. We've recovered the last major codex, and it appears to be in remarkable condition. Wonderful news. Excellent work, Miss Torres. But, um, I'm afraid you're going to have to find someone else to help you with the translation. I don't think this is working out like I'd expected. I can finish out the week, but... You signed the contract. That was before I knew what is was that? on here. Now that you know... Uh, That's Poe's father from... You can't talk to her like that. Kung Fu Panda. Forgot the name of that guy, the actor. Until you translate every last codex. Am I understood? You can't keep us here against our will. Come on, baby. We're out of here. <laughs> us? Marlo! Get your hands off me! Back up. Let her go. <laughs> Mr. Briggs, I'm afraid I'm going to have to let you go. Uh, distraction in the workplace will not be tolerated. Kill the boyfriend. No! No! Use that. What? Well, definitely don't shoot him from that distance because you're likely to hit one of your friends by accident. When people tell me no. No! Oh, God, please! Wow, you do not mess with Mr. Ping. James Hong. Thank you, Dan31. I was trying to remember his name. These gentlemen to my helicopter, I will be along momentarily. And to think, we almost made it an entire day without a workplace accident. <laughs> Wait, what? How did I get out here with this monstrous thing sticking out of my chest? And I'm not exactly certain why they decided they had to kill me with this. Whoa, I'm the mask. Oh, come on, I wanted to do that. Whoa, such lead flares. That's amazing. Thieves, dogs, they have looted the temple. May they 
shall come torrent of pus. Wait. Wait, so I'm wearing the mask Any idea? up here? Simple. Kukulkan's fangs can snap that with like a twig. Who am I? Who Am I just am I the mask watching Marlow from afar? Is that another death mask? Indeed. Only the secret warrior can see their spectral form. Okay. Whoa. You know what this game reminds me of? I don't know about this. Azuric, the Rise of Parathia. The first uh, Xbox game I ever played. Oh, man. There is a lot of spectacle in here for a game that seems to have had a pretty low budget. Pretty, pretty slick responsive controls too. Can I? What? What are these things? Oh, I hit them. Okay. Remove this obstacle. Then let us be on our way. Interesting. They have this distinction between the experience things that you hit and the ones that you grab. But they look almost the same. Whoops, look. The land of my people. Still as beautiful as I remember. But something feels wrong. I keep having this impulse to move the camera, but that causes me to dodge. This is God of War style controls. Uh yeah, for two as I got a cold. I'm uh sick at home right now because I don't want to be sneezing on all of my coworkers. I haven't been getting work done though. It's going to be a <laughs> I'm just gonna murder a bunch of people. I used to be a fireman, but I'm just gonna just kill everybody right now. No reservations. That's what you get for hanging out with evil Aztec gods. Teach these rogues to peer the wrath of the sacred warrior. Oh yeah! Class in session. Hey, hey, come back. Where are you going, jerk? See, that was inevitable. I don't know why you were uh, trying to delay it. Well, what, what can I do? I, what can I do with that? Okay. Hey, bud. Hey, come back. I don't know what the point is of having these guys run away. I mean, I'm going to catch them, and I'm going to kill them. It just makes the game last longer. Man, these guys are just bleeding magic orbs. Hang Long. His name is Hang Long. Everything this guy touches just explodes. So all of the names of my moves are popping up on the right side. I almost want him to be announcing them in VO. LT? Okay. <laughs> nice. Can I get on this? 
Yes, sacred warrior. Your bravery is an inspiration. Holy crap! Attention, security forces. Yes. Shoot me. Shoot me, come on, shoot me! Feel free to jump in any time! What am I? Is this just a giant cable car I'm riding? <laughs> this game is just nothing but spectacle! Teach you to wield flame. Oh, execute. <laughs> what? <laughs> this game is seriously ninety five percent explosions. Ow! Ow! Oh, oh, I guess that wasn't useful. Okay, let's try this again. There we go. Okay, I kept tapping left trigger when I really needed to hold it. Okay, that didn't work. Uh, you blow up with that. That's great. Let's uh, fix our health. Ah, what the? You might have mentioned the machine gun. There we go. Then you would not experience the joy of discovering it for yourself. Wait, can I? Can I do that? Okay, hold on. Shoot! What? So this challenge, does that mean that there are some choppers that I could fail to shoot down? Like, did I just miss one? Man, how, what is the scale of this operation? I think I've failed to shoot them all down. You let that one by. Oh! No, maybe not. Interesting. <laughs> Curious who says that I should not trust this mask. I don't know if I have a choice. Let's upgrade our weapons and stuff. Guess we'll do this one. Wait, does that mean I have two now, or does that mean that I could potentially have two? Alright. Man, this is so exactly God of War. Somebody's just like, let's just make a modern God of War with a new protagonist. Which is fine, especially if you're going, like, 
if you have a low budget, you know, no marketing, anything, I mean, no opportunity to really, uh, you know, take a risk. Yeah, go go for it, you know, take something else and, uh, you know, take some other inspiration and totally make something that uh, that's varied on the, on the content side instead of the mechanical side. I have no problem with that. Well, now when somebody does have a big budget, you know, and, and they are charging $60 for the game, you do expect a little bit more innovation than that. But for a game I spent a dollar on, having it be just, a, you know, a clone of God of War with some new content and a ridiculous amount of spectacle, I'm fine with that. Man, my nose is just driving me crazy. I can barely breathe out here. Oh, what? Let's get that going. Oh. I thought because it was a ramp, it would... I think that's my favorite combo. That's X, X, Y right there. There's X, Y. Oh, wait, that didn't work yet. Is that what it called? Oh, if it doesn't hit, I don't get the name. Oh, the Thousand Fangs. There it is. Yeah, Cloudcraft, a lot of that depends on uh What? What am I doing? <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> Is this real? Is this real life? I'm stuck to this thing now. I can't get it off the edge of this, though. I think I may have run into a bug. Can I pull it back? Oh, I can release it. Okay, I just can't push. Oh, I'm trapped behind some collision now. Man, this was going so well. All right, let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can do it again. Uh, can I push it this way? Nope. Oh, man. Man, I was having a great time! I think I'm supposed to do this, but I, uh... I'm not seeing a way to. <sighs> Let's see what happens if I reload a checkpoint. <laughs> Dan's giving me breathing advice.
Maybe there's something unrelated I'm supposed to do. Let's see what happens if I don't push that thing down there. Oh, I can't get in without it. get in there and see if there's anything else I can do. Maybe I'm not supposed to bring this all the way up. Maybe I'm just supposed to bring this in because it lets me get inside and then I'm just supposed to jump around. Maybe the fact that I can get it this far is just an accident. Oh. Ah, what the? Okay. Oh my gosh! The secret warrior cannot fail due to a secret. Uh, I feel like I can tell where all the money went. It went to that first opening sequence. Whoa, whoa, what? I wasn't supposed to... I wasn't supposed to push that at all? Holy crap! Okay, so the bug wasn't failing to get the section to work. The bug was they allowed me to push that thing, and that wasn't the intent. <laughs> Ow. I'm pretty sure that, like, Kratos may have even had the exact same attacks, some of the same combos. Like that one in particular just feels very Kratosy. I said B, B. Okay. Here's who says, I was thinking too much like uh, like that last section was a puzzle, but really the game is much simpler than that. <laughs> it's just throw things and explode. It's kind of like uh, full throttle compared with uh, Maniac Mansion or Day of the Tentacle. Alright. Here we are. What was this? Got something. So this is just a secret. So where am I actually headed? Ah! What are you guys doing here? Door for Princesses show hole? I thought that was part of a, uh, what was that, a Netflix ad? Talked about show holes? Do your part to keep Diage reminds 
They're only now requiring a double jump. Interesting. Uh, so much experience lying around. You can use one of the ropes to cross. Locked, 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 locked. Oh, I guess I could. There we go. Why not? This is a truly enormous complex. Marlo, I heard from the guards that you survived. How is that possible? We paused the game to listen to audio logs. Excuse me, I've got to wipe my nose. All the secret warrior stuff can't be true, can they? I guess I'm hopeful enough to leave you these messages. Don't worry about me. I'll do whatever Long wants and I'll be back as soon as I can. You promise not to hurt me or my family. I'll hide these notes for you whenever I can. Wait, so she figured out that I'm alive? I don't remember her seeing me like this. I might have missed something. I was distracted. Why did they build this turret right here? I'm not facing a lot of resistance right now. There we go. Ah! Did I take it too long? There we go. Now what? Uh oh. Alright, this is kind of clever. Wait, did I succeed or fail? Oh, there I am. Okay. Quick time events! <laughs> what the crap? Oh, did I screw it up? I couldn't tell if I succeeded or not. I mean, obviously not, but at the time, I wasn't sure. Good. 
No, back where you came from. Why? And then it'll be a B, and then it'll be an A. B and A. Time passed. This is like that scene in Deadpool. <laughs> They're having time passes. I go, okay, this is a clever idea for a shot. It's just, uh, <laughs> I'm not sure. Not sure why it's right here. I could do that? Wait, how did I get here? What's going on? I can fly like Superman. I have magic powers. <laughs> now that's what I call some serious firepower. Feel the burn. Wait, what? Are we riding a flying helipad? What is happening? Yeah, Cloudcraft, that's the thing I was going to say, too, is that, you know, a lot of times the decisions you make about a game that you're building has a lot to do, with, when you're a small team, has a lot to do with the comp composition of your team. If you're very high on artists and animators, make a content-heavy game. If you're very high on coders, then you make a mechanics-heavy game. This, one, this game definitely feels like it was high on artists and animators. What do I have now? And how many pans am I going to do in this sequence? Oh, hello. Man, somebody loved this technique. <laughs>
Oh yeah, I am. Sorry. I'll be done in a sec. Uh, yeah, let me just, I'm going to mute the mic for just a sec. had a lot to do today and so part of me staying home sick means that I'm uh, participating in, in some of the plans so we need to talk that through. <laughs> All right more mobile freeze frame shots. So I just, I just shot a few bugs and then we're moving on. And now I'm up in helicopters. What's happening here? I lose track of something. I feel like we're doing a lot more of this than playing the game right now. I think I need to quit. I got some uh, other stuff that I gotta get done, but uh, thank you all for being here, and you know what? This game is pretty cool. I gotta say, like, of all the games out there you could spend $1 or $5 on, uh, there are a lot out there that you know, have, you know, innovative, interesting new mechanics, and that, you know, sort of challenge you in that direction, uh, but there aren't a lot that get, achieve this kind of spectacle uh, at that <laughs> at that price point, and so... I gotta say, this is this is kind of a uh, this is a unique and rewarding experience that I'm glad I've had. So anyway, I gotta go, but uh, I'm glad uh, that we played this, and we will exit it.